Okay, dominant energies. Orphaned. Somebody could be getting left behind or they were left behind, feeling out in the cold, having struggles, material struggles. I get a sense that this card, like somebody doesn't have anywhere to go. Angel of Balance. Change reversed. Something is um, trying to change or somebody's fighting off a change. Some kind of growth, evolution, or movement. I understand that I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. This is reversed. So somebody's got to change. Okay, the Shadow Queen acquiring knowledge insecurity, manipulation. And generosity, receiving, withholding. Somebody could be um, in this energy manipulating for a place to stay or um, for shelter. Okay, somebody is way too money hungry. Somebody's trying to cock block or create some kind of blockages. Somebody will be getting bad karma tenfold. Deceptive. Somebody's trying to find a way to steal money from you. Okay, somebody in this energy could be pregnant or they got somebody pregnant. Somebody is dealing with a karmic that is desperate to get their attention. All right, somebody's money hungry in this energy. So I see money here twice, getting bad karma, trying to clock block or create blockages. Somebody could be pregnant in this energy and someone's desperate. I feel like, um, yeah, they're in the Eight of Swords. They're in the Eight of Swords, stuck, feeling trapped, feeling like there's no other way out. Maybe trying to have you or somebody else in this energy. Four swords reverse. Yeah, someone is stressing over money. They may be getting kicked out of somewhere. Orphans. Some situation is balancing out. Somebody don't want to change. They're too busy trying to manipulate or something. Insecurity. Withholding. Receiving generosity. What else? The money hungry. Ace of Pentacles, yeah. They need money or they need money from you. K, 
Okay, Queen of Pentacles reversed. The Hermit. Knight of Wands reversed. There's frustrations. They're getting um, very frustrated, feeling powerless, feeling out of control. They are on their own. Three of Pentacles reversed. King of Wands reversed. Could be a masculine energy also. Knight of Swords reversed. Page of Wands. Oh yeah, someone's pissed. Judgment. Something is being revealed. Exposed, revealed. Could be something about a decision. A life-changing decision. Uh, yeah, rude awakening. Rude awakening, a wake-up call. Trumpets are, trumpets are being blown. Ten of Wands reversed. Could be a um, a um, a karmic. These look like karmics to me. These people look real selfish, narcissistic. Yeah, someone's running from the truth or in denial about the truth. They're real arrogant. Cocky, yeah, someone's stressing over money. They could be trying to, um, this could be thieves or criminals or doing criminal things, criminal activity. I see somebody trying to separate themselves financially from somebody else. Stressing over uh, finance. Okay, what else, Spirit? Money hungry or stressing over some money or finance? Indecision. Venus in seventh house. This could be a Libra. Somebody wants you guys to be confused or all in your head about money or something like that. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Achievement reversed. This could be a Capricorn. Maybe this person's um, not achieved, underachieved. This could be somebody that doesn't take care of themselves or not in the position to take care of themselves. Irresponsible. This person could be somebody that's very vain, superficial. They, yeah, there's something they need to do. They need to change. They're trying to steal money or manipulate or trick somebody for money. Financial insecurity, Queen, uh, King of Wands reverse. This person could be very unmotivated, unambitious also. Ninth house, Sagittarius. Venus and Sagittarius reverse. Okay, yeah. They're letting me know. This person is really angry. Male or female, but this King of Wands reverse is this energy is very, very frustrated, angry. Could be very controlling. Knight of Swords reverse. Extremism. Mercury in eighth house. Scorpio. To be codependent on somebody's finances or other people's possessions. It looks like somebody's, they look like they're fighting over a document or something on that card. Yeah, they're too busy trying to manipulate your mind or somebody's mind. Four storage reverse. Running from responsibility. Moon in Taurus, yeah. Exaltation. So they're stressing over money. Feeling trapped. Powerless. No way out. Maybe feeling like a victim. Feeling out of control. 
Somebody's going to have to embark on something new and do something with this Page of Wands. Somebody in this energy is doing everything they can do so that they don't have to take physical action and do something or work or get motivated or seize new opportunities. You guys could not be helping them or um, they're feeling like somebody's not helping them. Group conflicts. Yeah, someone's on their own or something. The hermit, judgment. They're going to have to be independent, it looks like. Hermit, judgment. Second house. Venus and second house. This could be something about a romance for some of y'all. Show me this Four of Swords reverse. Dressing over finance. Something about a message or some kind of communication. King of Wands reverse. Yeah, they got to change. This person's fighting off some kind of change or changes. Could, like, yeah, it could be a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person could be getting ready to move. Somebody in this energy is going to be getting ready to move somewhere. Knight of Swords, Reverse. They're doing extreme things so they don't have to change or lay a situation to rest. Coffin. Queen of Pentacles, reverse. Thoughts. Yeah, they're thinking a lot about money or something or someone else. Could be thinking about something with their career or their job with this 10th house. Could be a parent. Judgment, hermit. Somebody could be single in this energy or getting ready to be. Distant Horizons and Knight of Wands reversed. Indecision. Knight of Wands reversed. Great Fortune. They're angry over someone's great fortune or your great fortune. Your blessings, maybe your wealth. These could be hidden enemies too. With the seventh house, Venus in seventh house. Somebody's angry, pissed off, aggravate. They're aggravated because you're in the Ten of Wands reversed. Someone's in the Ten of Wands reversed, not stressed. You're in the opposite energy. You're not stuck. You're not stressed. You're not burdened. You're not feeling burnt out. They can't suppress you. They can't weigh you down. They can't pin you down. They can't make you angry. Somebody doesn't want to take accountability is what it is. Could be playing the blame game or um, shifting the blame on you or throwing responsibility on you. You're not. Somebody better figure something out real quick because this is not on you. I don't feel like who was in this great fortune. It ain't on you. Angel of balance, someone's angry because your life is balanced and they're in this orphan energy. Desperately need some uh, money or something like that. How about this King of Wands reverse? Because they're showing me a lot of anger. King of Wands reverse. Something about marriage. Marriage, sweet love, couple. This could be a couple. This could be a couple that's trying to steal or uh, manipulate somebody. Dependency. Dependency. 
loss marriage and then loss for some of y'all this could be a loss somebody gonna lose a marriage bereavement sorrow damage there's a number 13 on that card so something's ending this could be somebody's romance ending or marriage ending okay um okay what is this four swords reverse message moon and taurus so this is about finance money real estate reverse well somebody could definitely be losing real estate or assets homes wealth jobs relaxation reverse somebody is not able to relax they could be investing a lot of their time or money into magic this magic is here reversed that magic ain't gonna cut it they gotta do something they need to get a job with this ace of pentacles heading for a fall well i just heard something about they're cowards these are cowards or something imposter something about some imposter or some cowards these could be people that bullied you guys they think you're the blame or something like that for their financial issues knight of swords reversed luck this could be something about a check let's see a check here or um something about a lotto fortune reward jackpot yeah it's like they're mad because they feel like you're lucky somebody feels like you're lucky you're fortunate you're blessed like you don't deserve that or you don't deserve to be in the position you are in life so it looks like they wanted to end that for you with this coffin they wanted to lay that situation to rest for you whatever good news this is you could have announced some good news recently with this page of wands I feel like for a lot of you guys, somebody either seen a message or they got some kind of message or something about you and your good fortune. Some They seen some good stuff about you and things balancing out for you and they're pissed. They immediately got pissed off or angry. Queen of Pentacles reverse. Something about family. Home, background, bonds. Imagination, variety, fantasy, mind. Okay, okay. Spirits let me know they're delusional. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles reverse is this person that's money hungry, they need money desperately. They're trying to imagine in their mind, like, you're going to take losses or you're going to have their life or their destiny, their bad karma. Yeah. On their own. This is spirits let me know on their own. Orphaned on their own. This is their karma. They're being judged for their deeds that they did in the past. Wow. Okay, judgment hermit. This could be something about friends or friendship. Connection network team. Top of the deck, nightmare. Death ending. Frightened. Yeah, whoever this is is hella scared. Something about your self-esteem, your self-worth. Your goal-oriented. Yeah, somebody like... They need you to be robbery. It's like they need you to be not shit or a bum so they can i don't know somebody's just doing magic though they're angry because you're in a good position in life is what i'm seeing knight of wands reverse they're angry and trying to create disturbances or irritate you obscure this could be a, a man and a woman trying to do this They want you to be irritated or something or frustrated. Okay, four swords reverse. Something about a message or some kind of communication about money or civility. 
Money hungry. Four swords reverse message. Ten of wands reverse. Yeah, it's like they wanted you to carry the burden. Ten of wands reverse. You're not. Maybe you told them no or you're learning how to stand up for yourself and tell people no. Could ask you for a financial favor. As someone's not carrying their burden. Not being held accountable, responsible for their issues. This has got them hella stress. Sun reverse. Very sad, very upset. This could be somebody low vibrational. They're trying to hide their stress. Could be depressed. This person's in a dark place. Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. They're looking at you like you got gains, increases, maybe more income, a new job. They're looking at you like you're in the Ten of Pentacles. You could be somebody wealthy or this is somebody wealthy they're looking at like this. They're looking at like, like how dare you be in the Ten of Pentacles and I got to struggle. I got to be out in the cold orphan and poor or something like that. That's sad, but um, yeah, this person ain't got nowhere else to go. I really strongly feel like that is sad. It's just sad that somebody will be stressing out about you having wealth or income or money. That's all they're thinking about is what you got. Could, this could be new investments too. You're manifesting more money or making more money. Um, you could be attracting new things into your life. Manifest the new things. Something new here. Maybe a new home is something new here for you. And they're going to take a loss. They're losing wealth. They're losing wealth, losing money. Wow. I'm going to lose a home. Wow. Yeah, so we're saying they're blaming you. They're blaming you. Wow. Three pentacles reverse. They're, I feel this like teary energy. Queen of wands. Yeah, you're not helping them. Three pentacles reverse. They could have they could have started issues with you. Somebody wants you to help with them or team up with them, but you're not. Queen of Wands, two of Wands. You could be kicking them up out of your house or they got to go somewhere. You ain't got to go home, but you got to get the hell up out of here. <laughs> That's what this feels like. Damn. Yeah, you ain't helping them. Um, for some of y'all, this could be somebody that's not doing business with these people anymore. So they got to make a change. Real estate reverse. Yeah, it's time to take action. Page of Wands. Five of Wands. And the Hierophant. They're fighting off. They're fighting off a change. These, these, these could be people competing with you. Could be something with your marriage or a contract. Taurus. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Wow. Someone's competing with you, I feel like, for a lot of you guys. Yeah. They're they're fighting, competing for help or for you to help them. This could be something about some kind of welfare, too. They could not want you to have any help or assistance. King of Wands reversed. Five of Wands again. Damn. Some drama or something. Feels like it's some kind of war or some warfare or some shit over some money. King of Wands reversed. That person's got to change. Ten of Swords. Oh, yeah. They're trying to, um, yeah, spiritual warfare. They could be attacking you guys. I've been seeing that out a lot. Attacks, spiritual attacks. They want you to have harsh endings in your life or go through some kind of pain. 
this could be somebody that's betraying you or trying to betray you. Okay, some of y'all could be severing ties with somebody in this energy. What is this um, Sagittarius energy? This King of Wands reverse change. It might be moving. Magician. What is this person? Oh. Magician, Three of Swords. All they're doing is manifesting and attracting their own heartbreak and pain. They want you to go through some kind of tower moment. Yeah, Ace of Swords. This is clarity for somebody. They want you to take a fall or have a fall from grace or be looked at like a disgrace or something like that. They want you to go through towers and disruptions and upheaval and all this chaos and all this shit in your life. No, that's this is this person or these people. That's all they're doing. They're trying to met. They want you to be in this energy. That's them. They're just hurting themselves, trying to hurt you, basically. Damn. They could be trying to diss you to other people, talking shit about you, gossiping about you to other people. I just heard something about they didn't ask you permission. Somebody didn't ask you for permission for something. I feel like these people are really immature. Knight of Swords reverse. They think the only way to get money is to steal or cheat or rob be deceptive or manipulate knight of swords reverse hanged man reverse yeah they're playing the victim they think they're the victim this could be somebody that's real stubborn they don't want to change they refuse to change they could want you to martyr yourself or people please I'm seeing somebody spreading a lot of lies about you or lying on you. Knight of Swords reverse. Three of Wands reverse. They don't want to own up to anything. Three of Wands reverse. Four of Wands reverse. Looks like um, trouble. Wow, so they're letting me know for some of you guys, these people teamed up like for you to have some kind of demise or some kind of fall to make you look bad or look, make you look like somebody you, you're not. Yeah, Could be a family or a group of people. Somebody's about to lose a home or something or move out, that's what I'm seeing. That could be a big stress for them. Yeah, eight of wands. Somebody's moving. They may be getting communications about this, or somebody's going to receive some kind of communication. Could be trying to um, punish you and stuff. So there's a loss, or going to be a loss. There's a lot of codependency here. Doing extreme things so they don't lose something. Real estate reversed. What is this Queen of Pentacles reverse thinking about? Ace of Swords, Page of Swords, Death Reverse. This person um, either got a letter or some kind of message recently about something. Or they're getting ready to. They could be thinking about that message or letter or some communication or something you said. Something it's some kind of truth. They can't avoid the truth. They can't avoid something unavoidable change. This person don't want to change or end something out. They keep trying to cause stagnation. Okay, what is this with this imagination? Queen of Coins reverse. Ace of Cups. Okay, yeah. They're, like I said, they're trying to imagine like you're going to take losses or something. Imagination. Two of Swords. 
Yeah, they're delusional. They're trying to believe everything else but the reality. They can't deal with their reality or something like that. They want you to be confused. Something with your intuition. We're on the fence, indecisive. They're trying to block out the truth, possibly from you or their family or friends. I see friends here, family. I also see somebody trying to ruin somebody's marriage. Imagination. Four of Wands reverse. Yeah. They're trying to imagine that you're going to take losses. They, I'm seeing like they're trying to imagine you're going to lose a house or a home or your living situation. But it's really them. Mm -hmm. They're unhappy. They're miserable, possibly depressed. They're, that's so, that is so sad. They're trying to imagine like that's you. Okay, Knight of Wands. Show me this Hermit Judgment. Knight of Cups. Chariot Reverse. Yeah, these people are stuck or something. They're stuck in life. They're on their own, orphaned. Maybe they don't have family to go to or what. But um, they're feeling stuck and powerless. Don't know how to move forward. They need someone's help. Possibly a Queen of Wands help. They need somebody's help. Whoever's in this Angel of Balance energy. They need your help. They're trying to manipulate you or something. And Knight of Wands reverse. What is this disturbances they're doing? Because they're angry. You must have turned your back on them or you're getting ready to. Or you've been disillusioned. Came out of a confused mindset. You could have found some truth out. Strength reverse. Yeah, they're purposely doing something to try to tear you down, bring you down. With your confidence, your self-esteem. They could be trying to dim. Um, it's like they're trying to dim your light. They want you to be weak and cowardly and just give in to them. Wow. It's like they're trying to bully somebody into submission, it feels like. And then they're getting angry because you're not. These look like bullies to me. Knight of Wands reverse. Bullies. These people are dark. They're, they're hella dark. Low vibrational. They look like they're trying to bully you down for some money. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, they need your help desperately. Six of Coins. Why would you help somebody that's bullying you or doing whatever this is? They want you in the Eight of Swords, possibly trying to guilt trip you. Wow, they want you blind to the truth. I'm sorry, I just keep seeing that. They're delusional. Wow. So are they angry about someone's great fortune? Great fortune, Knight of Wands reverse, disturbance. King of coins, hoarding, inheritance, unwillingness to share. It could be something about an inheritance. So somebody's hoarding money or being selfish. Indecision. King of Swords, powerful person, harsh lessons, Ace of Skates, instability, danger, uselessness. So some instability. Someone's pissed off over. <laughs> 